and it's not actually so hot, but I've been everywhere, and everywhere was a problem, so we're just going to push forward through this video. I'm going to show you guys what I got. I went to Trader Joe's and BJ's. In this video is BJ's. Uh, Trader Joe's will be a separate video, so keep your eye out for that if you're looking for that, and let's get into it. Okay guys, so I don't know if you remember, but in my grocery haul this week, I mentioned that I am catering an event on Saturday doing pulled pork trays. So um, I got four of these 16 pack of hamburger rolls because the large adult size will be served on this. And then I did get um, 120 pack of these like a clamshell kind of containers to serve the food in. Um, yeah, she can have some more of those. Um, I got two of these double 16 packs of the King Hawaiian Rolls, so it's 32 in each because this will be the children's option and whatever I do not use, we will throw in the freezer because these are our favorite buns and we buy these anyway, so um, whatever we don't use will certainly not go to waste. Um, I got my regular 18 pack of English muffins, that's a standard for us each month. Uh, this time I got their Arnold 100% whole wheat. I got the double pack. I actually had a coupon for this, so I chose this one this time. I got a big package of um, brujut. I have it cut really, really thick, and I usually chop this in half, and I'll get two meals out of it. I use this to make my penial vodka, or if I make chicken marsala or something, I use the fresh brujut in there. Um, this... Leanne from Grady's Mom, she always, always talks about this, and there was a coupon in the BJ's um, ad, so I had to try it. Um, this is the Talenti Gelato, and it's coconut almond chocolate. It's like it called my name and screamed to me, so I'm looking forward to trying that. This is a rebuy for us. We really like the um, Muir Glen Organic Tomato Paste. I always go through these. My case of Tutoroso, love this one. It's the six pack of the 28 ounce cans, and these are the ones with basil. We love these. Uh, these are my favorite tomatoes. I absolutely love them. We get them every time, and they really have a very long shelf life, and they hold for a while. So we usually don't waste any of these. Our mission wraps, we get these all the time. It's a staple for us. Um, my box of bacon. Last month, I actually went back and returned my bacon because there was a whole three pack in the freezer and I didn't realize that. Um, but now we're only down to one. So now I bought this one and I won't buy it next time because they won't go through it all before I go back again. Um, my Welsh's grapes, they haven't had them in a really long time. By far the best grapes ever. They are $3 um, a pound, but there's three pounds in here and it was only $6.98. So I'm not really sure why they have it advertised for $3 a pound unless it was some kind of clipless coupon that I didn't see. Um, but this rent only rang up $6.98, so that's a great deal for three pounds of the grapes, especially the Welsh's ones because they're awesome. Um, there was a coupon for this, $2.50 off any of the Wesley Farms um, grated cheeses. So we got the parm. This is a buy for us all the time, too, if not every month, every other month. This is the Land Lakes White American Cheese. We always do the White American since it's not dyed. I got five bags of these coleslaw because that's one of the sides for the pork plate. I was going to get their homemade coleslaw, but I was very unimpressed. They were very expensive. Taste tasted wonderful, but for me to get what I needed, I think it would be better for me to prepare it myself. So I'm hoping this is the smarter um, choice because now I still have to buy the dressing and theirs was very expensive. Um, only the Mexican cheese blend this time because I bought shredded mozzarella sargento during the week on sale. We got our organic yellow corn tortilla chips. That is a many time repeat buy. We love those. They were giving out the Tyson chicken nuggets as a sample today, although I always do buy them. It just made me think like I should pick up a bag being that we're on summer break, so we got that. I actually have a whole sleeve of the four pack of butter in there, but I'm serving a chocolate chip cookie on the side of this pork plate, so we're gonna go through butter. So I grabbed this as a backup. My normal two gallons of milk, a two pack of Welsh's grape jelly, here are the two huge cans of the Bush's baked beans that I'm using as sides for these pork plates also. 
Um, that is another repeat buy, and there was a $2.50 off coupon in the paper for the Stony Fields organic yogurt pouches. There's eight in there, four strawberry, four blueberry. Mason loves them. Um, these are our organic ketchup. We get this every time, and this was a dollar off clipless coupon, so I grabbed it. I don't even really know if we need it, but it's the summertime, and we'll always go through it, and it was on sale. Um, okay, now down to the meats. So this is the last of the purchases to show you guys today, but I pretty much have stocked up on enough meat now that I don't think I'll need anything else for the rest of the month. They had some really good deals today. So uh, $7.85 for this 10-pack of the center cut boneless um, pork chop. So I'll get two meals out of this when I cut this in half. They had really awesome, these, the country style pork loin spare ribs. Um, and there's 10 of these in here as well. So I will get two meals out of this. Um, now this ground beef, I used to buy ground beef from Walmart all the time, but it's $3.49 at Walmart for the 80-20 of that log roll. I never really minded it too much. And then now they are, now their standard price at BJ's is $2.89 and it's for the $85.15. So I've been getting my ground beef for the month there every time now. So we got a five and a half um, pound thing and that should last us for the month. And then last but not least, I got the chicken cutlets. I usually get these as well from Walmart Standard because they're always $1.99, but they were $1.69 this time. Now I just bought chicken over the weekend, but again, something else that will not go bad in our house is chicken. So I grabbed another one of these and that is it. Yes, sir. Be quiet. I'll be quiet. Okay. I'm sorry. It's you who needs to be quiet. You silly butt. Um, okay. And that is it. So thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. If you guys liked BJ's and what I got on this haul, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Tell me your favorite things you get from BJ's. If you're new to my channel and you'd like to catch some more videos, you can hit my face right there to subscribe. If you missed my last video, you can catch that in the box right here and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.